you really want to know which sock is the sock that yes. is going to help you achieve orgasm the quickest. Is it the athletic sock with arch compression? Is it the fuzzy warm socks that your grandmother gets you for Christmas? Is it the thick hiking sock that you wear and double layer when you go on very difficult hikes so that your ankles <laughs> don't, you know, tear and get ripped and blister? <laughs> we want answers. <laughs> Hi, I'm Adriana. Hi, I'm Chloe. And we're playing True or False Sex Edition. Dun, dun, dun. Listen, I'm gonna just go right ahead and say that I'm pretty confident going into this because my dear mother got me sex books from like the age of 12. I'm gonna fail. Oh, I'm definitely gonna fail. I'm the most gullible person on the planet. So my fiance told me that the way that they do breast lifts is they take the string underneath your skin and tie it into your earlobe, <gasps> and I believed him. I believe it. I think they're gonna be trick questions, but I'm really hoping that I <laughs> went into, you know, that big responsibility of the birds and bees knowing some things. That's a good point. Shouldn't be doing it if you don't know about it. <laughs> but I have an IED. <laughs> Same. <laughs> True or false, okay. sex can temporarily wipe your memory. I would say true. true. Oh God, this is gonna go I think bad. I think that's true. Oh, you really mm -hmm. went in there. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly this happened to you. I don't remember reading this in any of my textbooks, but I think I'm gonna go with true. Yeah, Mrs. Chung did not say whether or not it would wipe your memory, but I feel like it'd be true. Woo! Oh, yeah. We have a tiny bit of knowledge. You know what? Maybe things are just believable. Penis and shoe sizes are correlated. That's, that's gotta false. be false. I think that's like an urban legend, like an old wives tale. Okay, I know that's false. Yeah, a lot of people say it is, which is why I think it's now false. So don't go walking around looking at people's feet. That's not gonna tell you anything. I heard this when I was a kid. Well, I was <laughs> like, oh my God, I'm gonna look at boys' shoes. Hey girl in a bar, look at my feet. And you're like, well, I'm a size nine. <laughs> oh, be careful. <laughs> Yep. Yeah! yeah! Wow, we're, we're so killing good. It. Come on, we're killing it. True or false, you're more likely to orgasm if you're wearing socks. What? What the hell? I hope this is true. I think this is true because it's so outlandish. It doesn't make sense because it would cut off the all the tingly nerves on the bottom of your feet. Yeah? Well, because it's like circulation, blood circulation, and keeping your extremities warm kind of helps. I mean, I've never heard this, so I'm like completely just guessing. But I'm gonna go with what you say since you seem to know. <laughs> I'm gonna go with false. I'm gonna go with false too. Yo, this is lit. That's amazing. Ladies everywhere. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, That's warm like fuzzies best. from yeah. now on. Who conducted that study? Can we talk about that? <laughs> Again now, but with socks, please. <laughs> <laughs> it's possible for people to get stuck together during sex. Oh my god. I'm gonna go with false, even though I saw an episode of Grey's Anatomy where two people got stuck together during sex, but I think it's because someone had like a penis piercing. That's true. That's. I'm pretty sure I've seen a Grey's Anatomy about this, and I believe it. I'm gonna say true, but I think I've heard of it in like, you know those stupid reenactment shows that are like, oh. sex took me to the ER or whatever it's called. I uh -huh. swear that's been like a few of the episodes, not that I watch it, I just like know about it. Yeah! Watch more TV. That's so yeah. gross. Imagine having to go to the ER stuck together. True or false, sex toys are banned in Alabama. I'm gonna go with true. No offense to the southerners who are watching this. It could just be one of those laws that like- Oh, one of those outdated laws that- That yeah. just like nobody like ever revisited. Oh, I'm sorry to Alabamians. I don't know, but I think that's true. I just want to cheat sheet. <laughs> I'm just going to cheat off of Merle. Uh, that's okay. so bizarre. Like, you have to go to another state if you want a vibrator. Like, what? <laughs> you get them delivered on Amazon, or is it just like not? Like, how does it work? Oh. They're just like not as yeah, into the state. Yeah, that's true. Amazon vehicles have to stop at the border. Complete sexual inactivity may cause penis size reduction. So if you don't use it, you might actually lose it. I feel sorry for men that believe that. I think that's false, and that's something that men say to get sex. Oh my god, I hope that's not true for poor men's sake. Okay, I feel like that's got to be true. I mean, all of the yeah, whatever like, body part, it'll atrophy if you don't use it that much. <laughs> well, actually, no, you're right. Thinking about it, I believe that that's false. Oh my god, I don't have a mind. Of my own. That's a false. What? <laughs> no. I had a whole passionate soapbox speech going. Wow. wow. That is so insane. No! That just gave what? validation to men everywhere. <laughs> The inventor of Kellogg's cornflakes believed his cereal would fight the urge to masturbate. <laughs> I don't know what to believe anymore. I know, I feel like that's true. I have a feeling it's true. I Did you just sit is. behind the camera and make these up? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say that he actually thought this. Back in the day, like inventions were very weird and people mm -hmm. claimed things that were very bizarre, so I would totally think this might be 
century. Yeah. True. Right? Hell um, yeah. I mean, like, why? But also, yeah, like, yeah. got it right. I think we did pretty well. Yeah. We got most of them right. We only got a mm -hmm. couple wrong. Mm -hmm. I mean, most of these are so ridiculous, they kind of have to be true. Honestly, I thought I was going to do so much better than this. I thought I'd done plenty of research at the age of 12. But I liked all the information we were presented, specifically the Kellogg's one. I feel like that's a fun fact. I'll just keep in my back That's pocket. what we're using this weekend. Yeah, that's go definitely out. like my party fact. I like these facts. I feel more knowledgeable now and have more tidbits of information to throw at people that are funny.